Welcome back. Okay, so today I wanted to talk about a topic that I, I really don't want to talk about these things and this stuff in general, but I feel like I kind of have to. Just in what we've seen over the last few years in sports really ramped up over the last few years, over the last decade even, just in general. I'm not a big politics guy. This isn't a channel for politics. It's a baseball channel. Recently, in the news, the Dodgers have been in the news, and they've been in the news for not the right things, right? They've been in the news for not the right things, and I'm not going to get into too much details. I will have it on the screen here, the, the Dodgers couple of posts that they posted here. It's all related to the Pride Night stuff that will be taking place next month. Of course, June is known as Pride Month. Boards and all of these big tech companies celebrate Pride Month throughout the month of June by turning their logos into rainbows, whatever the case is, they all do that. The Dodgers have been having Pride Day for a decade now. They invite groups of people, a group of people they invited received a lot of backlash from people on the internet, Dodger fans, whatever. And they disinvited them. You're seeing the post now, they disinvited these folks from attending the Pride Nights at Dodger Stadium. I didn't even know this was all going on. Like, I don't even look into what they're inviting and stuff, but it just randomly appeared and I was like, okay. And I, and I saw quickly thereafter, they were getting absolutely cooked. I mean, absolutely cooked in the comment section in the quote tweets. They were getting absolutely cooked. I mean, it was bad. That tweet by far has the most comments and views on any other posts. I mean, it's ridiculous. It's insane how that just quickly got a lot of backlash, right? So they disinvited those people because a certain group of people were not happy with them going. And then today, and then today, the Dodgers, out of again, out of left field, during the rain delay before the Braves game tonight with the Dodgers, they put up this post here and they basically said they are re-inviting them. They are re-inviting them. Baseball is a game of tradition. Baseball is America's national pastime. It's always been, to me, the most traditionalist game, honoring game, I guess. Like, it just has so much history with it. And, and to me, this stuff right here, you know, you're, you're pushing this agenda. And it's not just the Dodgers. A lot of these franchises have been partaking in this stuff. I mean, it's just in general, the world, I guess, the news has really been pushing this stuff. It's really just an agenda thing. Uh, I don't think the Dodgers or any other team for that matter really care. I'm going to be honest. I'm going to be blunt here. Me, myself, I don't want to see that, right? I go to the game to watch a baseball game. I don't go to a game for, you know, a pride night, any of that. That stuff doesn't appeal to me. I don't really go to the games for certain nights. I just go for the baseball, right? I go for the game, and that's all I care about. Some others, you know, I would say maybe a 5% people, maybe they do care about that stuff. Uh, maybe they go just for that. But to me, those people don't really care about what the Dodgers are doing on the baseball field. I'm going to be honest. And so you're really catering to a very, very small minority group of people here that don't care. Meanwhile, you're turning off a lot of other people. I mean, the this post today got a ton of comments, a ton of backlash. I mean, it has like 15,000 comments. According to this at night, it has like 15,000 comments. And it was reported like five hours ago. I mean, it's insane. So the Dodgers just, just doing it bad. I mean, it doesn't surprise me that they eventually did cave in. Like this organization as a whole, I've expressed my displeasure in the front office. I know that may sound odd or strange because they've done nothing but winning and they're winning again this year early on but one world series in 10 years doesn't satisfy me for as good as they've been they should have a lot more at least one more at the very least and to me they're okay with just good attendance with the league in attendance it's all about putting good product on the field and whatever happens in october whatever happens it's whatever then that's publicly been stated by the Dodgers front office. It's not just me just throwing that out there. They've expressed that. And so the Dodgers brass doing this move, it, it is a shame. Uh, it's unfortunate, but I guess as a whole, I don't want to see any of this stuff. I, I think sports as a whole should just cancel the whole Pride Night stuff. It, it just, it's bad. It's bad for business. To me, it's bad for business. And it's just, you got you to gotta stop. It's just not a good look for the Dodgers at all. It's a shame. That being said, you guys can let me know your thoughts down below in the comment section. I appreciate you guys for watching, and I will see you guys next time.